Patriot League play starts with a win for Lafayette over Bucknell by a 1-0 score. I'm Adam Dobrovolsky. We'll be joined by our player of the game, Brian Ehrlich, in just a minute. But first, with head coach Dennis Bond and coach, obviously starting off Patriot League play is a win. Awesome thing. Your thoughts over on the team's performance? Yeah, I mean, it's a Patriot League game. You know, very tight, one goal game one way or the other. Usually scoring first is huge, um, which we were able to do. Chris Moise stepped up, made a play, and uh, and the team then gave a great effort in the second half to create some chances and try and make it 2 nothing. but most importantly, kept it zero in the back. Obviously a beautiful goal scored by Christian Moise. Obviously a beautiful send on the corner by Andrew Venezia. In that type of situation, you, you were more defensive minded in terms of tactics to have that opportunity and for it to be converted in the first half. How much does that help out your approach in the second half? Yeah, I mean, it opens up the game a little bit. It forces them to probably have to send some more numbers forward, which might allow us some space to uh, get some more numbers in the attack, which happened. So again, scoring that first goal is huge. And, um, you know, just uh, defensively, we wanted to keep a zero in the back from the beginning. And we knew we would get some chances. And on the set piece, we were able to capitalize. Congrats on the win, coach. Thanks so much. And now with our player of the game, Brian Ehrlich, and obviously a lot taller than me, six feet, six inches tall, and you did a great job in goal, uh, not just obviously uh, physically protecting things, but helping uh, to regulate traffic. What has it been like the, these past two games, some defensive adjustments, you have more guys on the back line. How has that changed your approach in terms of directing traffic? Uh, it definitely makes it a lot easier. Uh, each game we're just getting sharper and sharper. Uh, more guys back is definitely helpful, but a lot of guys in the back are stepping up. Joe, Diego, Chris, all of them are making plays, and that's just what you have to do to win games. What has been the difference from, say, Wednesday against Albany non-league game to this on Saturday? You could sense the intensity from the booth. You can sense it from the crowd and obviously on the pitch as well. So I explain to, to those at home what the difference is in terms of intensity in a Patriot League match. Oh, uh, well, every college soccer is always an opportunity to play, but Patriot League just makes it that much better, that much more fun to get out of bed. And we play them four times in our career, so every time you want to go out and get a win. And it's just a lot of fun competing with them because these are the games that really mean something and will determine who's going to get into the playoffs at the end of the year. Congrats, Brian, and again, good job on the win. Thank you. Thank you. The next game for the Leopards will be on the road in Worcester, Massachusetts next weekend. But the next home match will be a midweek game early October with a 7 p.m. kickoff on the Patriot League Network. Until next time, for the Lafayette Sports Network, I'm Adam Dobrovolsky.